Hi, my name is Angela Lang and this is Mike Scott and we're from Ultra Industrial Motion and we're here today to talk about a few of the products that we're featuring here today at the packaging show. This is Boston Gear's new stainless steel 700 series worm gear speed reducer and this product has been designed to be optimized in washdown environments and there are several key features of the product that enable it to better withstand the washdown environment. The, the biggest feature is the rounded housing of the speed reducer and that helps to withstand any pooling of fluids and any potential bacterial growth that could happen on the top of the speed reducer. Other things to, to help with the pooling of bacteria or the pooling of fluids um, to withstand that are things like recessed screws, uh, caps over our screws, a two-piece base that enables maintenance managers or maintenance people to be able to caustic wash down or wash down and spray right under the reducer so particles can go right underneath. This is the uh, Warner Electric uh, Smooth Torque capping headsets. They're used on rotary capping machines. The uh, new headsets that Warner Electric has introduced at the show are smooth hysteresis torque. The primary benefit of this headset is that the uh, torque is perfectly smooth once it reaches its um, application torque limit and there's no pulsations like a lot of the magnetic headsets that are currently in the industry. The smooth torque gives better removal torques of caps from the bottles, more consistent, it eliminates tight caps. And then with the smooth torque technology, your retention knives last uh, twice as long and the spindles, keys, splines, and bearings in the, in the system also last much longer. The headsets are easy to maintain. Um, there's no calibration required. They're very simple and straightforward when it comes to rebuilding them. Uh, headsets will typically go 7,000 hours in a cycle without any maintenance. Um, and uh, we've had headsets run up to two years without being torn down or repaired. There's simple setting scales for both the top load and the torque. The torque scale has a one through five setting. It's a simple matter of loosening a couple of set screws, rotating to that position, and then retightening the set screws for setting torque. The top load, there are a couple of jam rings. Those jam rings are loosened. They're set to the proper scale number, and then retightened, and then the top load is set. And you can see the concentric rings on the top load spring covers, and that gives you an, a visual indication of the head rise setting for the machine. Thank you for visiting the Ultra Industrial Motion booth today. For more information, you can reach us at our website at www.ultramotion.com.